Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to add a calculator to Android Nougat's quick settings. Now, iOS has had a link to the calculator app in their control center for years, but even though Android's quick settings panel is pretty much the same, it doesn't have one of these. Thankfully though, a new feature in Android Nougat allows apps to create their own custom quick settings tiles, which means you can put a link to almost anything in your notification shade. Android Marshmallow had a somewhat similar feature, but it was using a hacky workaround and most manufacturers disabled the feature anyway. But this time it's an official API, so unless Samsung and friends go overboard with their customizations, this should work on pretty much any device running Nougat. Back on topic though, the app that adds a calculator to your Quick Settings panel is fittingly called Quick Settings Calculator. You can find it for free on the Google Play Store, so search it by name to get it installed or use the link in step 1 in my full tutorial. But once you've got the app installed, you don't even have to open it to set things up. Instead, just swipe down twice to fully expand your Quick Settings menu, then tap the Edit button in the bottom right corner. From here, scroll down to the bottom of the list and you'll find the calculator tile. Next, just long press the tile, then drag it up to the darker gray area near the top of the list. If you add it to one of the first five slots, you'll even see it when you open your notification tray, so that's what I'm going to do. But when you're done there, you're all set to go. The next time you need to do a little math, just tap the calculator icon in your quick settings, then you'll see a notification. From here, tap the darker area at the bottom, then your keyboard will come up. Now this is actually pretty cool, because it uses another new API called Quick Reply that lets you act on notifications. But anyway, just type out the math problem that you want to solve, then press the forward arrow on the notification. When you do that, you'll see the answer, and you can even tap it to copy the number to your clipboard. And really, since Apple's version of this only opens an app, this interactive calculator is even better. But while we're on the subject of the new Quick Settings API, you should know that there's a lot of new apps that can add almost anything to your Quick Settings panel. I've covered some of the best options for that with a separate article that you can find at the full tutorial for this one, so be sure to check that out. As always though, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking!